Good morning everyone, it's Mike and Jen from Finding Fish. Welcome to Cuba, welcome to Cayo Largo. It's about 7.30 in the morning. Um, we just came to El Rancho yeah. to start our day and grab a coffee. It's early morning today. Yeah. Sun shining. Coffee's welcomed. Welcome to our food tour. Um, today we're gonna be showing you what the El Rancho has, flavor has. We're gonna actually go and check out the a la carte's here. That's right and maybe the little cantina that I got a burger from the other day. So why don't you join us? Today is a beautiful sunny day and I think it's gonna be amazing. Okay, coffee is done at El Rancho. Yep. Actually, cappuccinos. We're gonna actually go to the 24 hour. Let's try a Spanish coffee yeah, from there. Sure. Let's, let's do a Spanish coffee and show you that. And some water. <laughs> and some water. Then we're actually gonna show you um, flavors. flavors. Yeah. We're gonna get a light breakfast. Um, and then actually on the way, we're gonna show you how quiet the resort is for eight o'clock in the morning. Now, it's low season here, but the resort is very busy. If this was high season, I this is going to be very busy, this I resort. Think so. It's a family resort, and there's a lot of rooms here, and I think it's a very popular resort. It seems to have a lot of followers yeah. and uh, a lot of loyal patrons. So, yeah. in the high season, this place can be packed. Really busy. But for a family resort, it's still surprisingly really quiet. Like, yeah. I love it. And awesome. And well laid out. Yeah. Anyway, let's, let's keep going. We're just on our way to the 24 hour. And uh, one thing I, I wanna mention, because I still get lots of comments, I just answered a comment right now after getting my shower, um, about the tipping. Um, and we've done prior videos on this, but there's still people that haven't seen those videos. With tipping, what we typically do is we bring uh, US dollar bills and we bring fives and Canadian $10 bills. Mm -hmm. And that seems to work out well for us and it works out well for them. Um, we were just at the uh, El Rancho, El Rancho yeah. and I asked Jorjito what he prefers and he doesn't mind anything. He just, they just can't do the coins and they'll still accept the coins, yeah. but we just bought about $40 worth of coins off of them. Um, exchanged, right? Sorry, exchanged. So they give us uh, $40 worth of coins and we give them $40 in Canadian and they love that because the yeah. banks here in Cuba will not take the, the coins. coins not the toonies and loonies they'll take paper bills and they have to be in good shape they can't really be ripped or torn or really worn right. um it's cuba they're very it's, it can be a difficult country so for us it works out well for us and it works out well for them but if you're interested if you really need to know about the tipping that's what we do oh anyway let's get our spanish coffee so this is the 24 hour I call it the lobby bar because it's it's right beside the lobby. It's on, to the left as soon as you walk through the lobby. Um, it's 24 hours, and this is where you're gonna get your hot and cold drinks, alcohol, non-alcohol, and uh, they make a good cappuccino, and they make a super strong Spanish coffee. Um, so we might share one, or we might get one each. I don't know what Jenny's ordering, but yeah. <laughs> okay, these look very strong. Oh, you're Holy jeez. <laughs> We'll see how this goes. Well, whoo, potent. I, I'll only need one. Mm. Same, delish though. It's like a lukewarm, which is mm. actually nice because yeah. the other day we were here, they were so hot you couldn't even pick up the glass. <laughs> anyway, it's like what I miss at some of the resorts is. It, it's like a stage and then they prepare so here you have such a great view and you can kind of hang out and you watch them It's an art form, right? And they're so good at it. They're very passionate about it. And I love that you could just stand there and watch them Yeah, so totally. It's an enjoyable 24-hour bar for sure and plus the outdoor seating which we love <sighs> Okay, Spanish coffees are done Now we're just walking to the main lobby here because that's where flavors is it's to the to the right of that 
But I'm gonna tell you right now because I don't think I even noticed this the, on the other video, but as you walk through the lobby and slightly to the right, that's your concierge. So that's where you're gonna book your excursions or talk to your travel rep. Okay, good morning. And you're your play part. Okay, breakfast is done and we actually just ran into the doctor the doctor told me that they work from um, 7 till about 5 or even 7 o'clock at night here um, there's a doctor and a nurse here but if you need something even more urgent than that they actually have a clinic that's 24 hours so you can either take a taxi there or if it's really bad they'll send an ambulance for you right. but just so you know um, there is a doctor and a nurse here on staff. And a taxi into cab is five bucks. There yeah, said. you know, so just so you know that, okay? And I believe that the doctor's office is kind of located behind the 24-hour bar, um, kind of over by the, um, the store. When you come out through the lobby and you turn to the left, you're going to see a women's and men's bathroom, um, which is really convenient because yeah, we, we, we all need to know where they are. Where to next? I don't know. I think we're going back to our room for a bit and then on to the beach probably. Okay, breakfast is done. Bathroom tour is done. Doctor's office is done. Now, we're off to the beach. Now, if you're interested in lunch, El Rancho's is located right on the beach, just up from it slightly, in uh, those little buildings. Now, Jenny and I love to come here, we love to hang out on the beach, and we love El Rancho's, so you'll find us here most days. Anywhere where they serve food and there's a beach, we're eating.
So we are in this little wee cabana right on the ocean and we're gonna enjoy a little lunch here. Um, now the little, uh, you can do the buffet, which I filmed and I showed you, but we opted out for a ham and cheese sandwich, some fried fish, and some potato chips, deep fried. Anyway, and this is our real estate. Wow. Doesn't get much better than this. The fish is excellent. Lunch is done. The beach is done. Yep. Um, we had, you know, you saw what we had. We had fish, potatoes. Delish. What else do we have? Uh, a ham, cheese. Ham and cheese and lots of water. Lots of water today. They're out of beer today, but they have plenty of red and white and sparkling wine. Um, but then I did see yeah. the beer show up when we left. As we were leaving. Anyway, we're going to get cleaned up. We've had a big day and we're going to get ready and go for dinner soon. Anyway, we're off to our room. We are cleaned up, beached out, lunched out, chilled out. We've had a fantastic day here, to be honest with you. Um, now, we just spoke with Rose, the concierge, and she told us that for regular gas, you get two a la cartes per week, but right now they only have the gourmet open, but that's, that's subject to change. Sure. Seagulls are loud. Yes. Diamond Club, you get three a la cartes per week, and if you're a returning guest, you get one extra. Yeah. So anyway, tonight we're just going to Flavors for dinner. Yeah, the buffet, uh, which has been amazing. The buffet has been amazing. So Flavors doesn't, right now, it hasn't been open for lunch. El Rancho's open for lunch. So Flavors opens at 6.30 in the morning for, till 10 for breakfast. Right. For dinner, it opens at... 6.30. 6.30 to 11. And, 11, that's late. Yeah, and El Rancho's is open from... 11.30 till 3. Till 3. Yeah. Anyway, there you go. Anyway, let's go. Let's go grab some food. Okay, so what are you doing for dinner tonight? Well, I have done the pasta and I've actually done the, the pizza. The guy at the pizza oven, it's been amazing. But I kind of like sharing yours, which has been... Well, I'm going to be doing a hamburger tonight for sure. So let's show you what they have to offer here before everyone gets in here. Now I have to say their cheeses and yeah. their little pastries and desserts are always amazing. I don't know what kind of cheese that is. I think it's a goat cheese. It's been really delicious. I'm going to do the pizza tonight with pretty much everything on it. And tonight I'm doing um, a triple cheeseburger on this ground beef because I'm going to tell you I've had this a few times this week and it's absolutely incredible. Now everything in here looks absolutely incredible. Um, and one thing I do love about Flavors, it's an open air eatery and there's no flies here.
Okay, dinner is absolutely done. I had two double little cheeseburgers made up and I'm gonna tell you right now, I don't typically ever get ground beef in Cuba. You don't ever see it. No. The chef told me that he actually just ground it up. It was fantastic. I've had it a couple times this week. It's delish. And it's delicious. Yeah. Tender as anything. You had a pizza. I did. And then you got a pasta. I did get, just to try. <laughs> And then, of course, I slopped it on myself <laughs> trying it. So, you know. Anyway, uh, the food here, I'm going to have to tell you. It's great. It is great. And people always say, ah, you know. No, no, seriously, the food was fantastic. Yes. And uh, I'm not, I'm not uh, scared to say that. You, no, we you played around in the ocean today and we, were, we burned a lot of calories and we needed a good hearty meal and we actually got it. Yeah. Look for yourself. We took a lot of video of it and yeah. enjoy because that's what it looked like today. Everything's subject to change. Always. They had lots of beer today, lots of wine, red and white. And, and champagne. And champagne. Anyway, thanks for watching our video. That's our food video of KO Largo um, Memories. If you like what you see, like and subscribe. And guess what? We're going to see you in the next video. Yeah. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a great day.